Hello everyone, this is Andy and I'm back with a new video. So in this video here, I'm going to demonstrate and basically it's a continuation from where I left off in the last video. Uh, because you may, you know, the reason why I want to make continuation videos is because uh, there's so many items and gear out there that you may feel, you know, uh, on this website here especially, that you may want to add. But the problem we're going to have is some items actually don't work, as I mentioned in the last video. But I'm going to go ahead and show you how to make it work, basically. So... What I'm going to go ahead and do is just dive right into the game here and just give you a demonstration of how this works, how you actually find the stats and how you actually load the stats into the game. So what we're going to do is go ahead and just dive right into it. I won't waste any time here. So uh, what I've actually done is I've actually preloaded uh, in my equipment, my item equipment folder. So basically I found this reference number on this website here on the... Um, Sorry, not here, the, the Final Fantasy XI Auction House. Uh, again, I recommend saving this page here because it will be in hand, it will come in handy in the, in the future. And you can actually find the gear here in this uh, this, uh, this BG Wiki, Final Fantasy. You can actually find uh, different items, especially when it comes to the higher level gear. If you're not too familiar with uh, gear is available, you can actually come here and find out what is, basically. So uh, when I came here, the battle content shows the different fields um, different monsters and, and such. So uh, what I did actually, I went to the ultimate weapons here. Uh, if you actually seen some of my old videos, you, you could, uh, you should have actually seen some of the equipment that I had equipped before, and I actually had the redemption gear, the redemption uh, scythe for the Dark Knight. Um, so if I go down to the scythe here, I go to redemption, and with this one we got pretty like I don't believe this one, the third level actually works, but again I'm going to show you how this can be done. To get the work so as you see the redemption gear if I go ahead and if I unequip it it's going to remove the stats over here so uh, the problem you're going to have is when you're adding for example the gauntlet tier so this is for the dark knight so level two nothing happens it should give me a lot of stats here as you can see uh, so 112 defense 39 HP 21 strength so it should be loading those to the game but nothing happens level one actually works as you can see everything pops up here level th two and level three nothing works so let me show you how to let me show you the work around this here okay so basically what we're going to do is go back into navicat here and look for the item equipment so uh, again i sorted everything out here in order to do that you're going to have to go to the page per record and just type in a thousand or just unclick the limit records sort it out you can either go uh, here view and sort to ascending or descending order and we we'll take the gauntlets here, the finger gauntlets. We we'll go ahead and go with the number three. Now, this is something I highly recommend. Uh, and again, you got to pay very close attention to this because uh, it's really confusing. So basically, what we're going to do is open uh, getting lost here. Okay, so I opened this separate table here. These numbers here, don't worry so much about right now. Uh, so I went ahead and typed in this number here, and this uh, this is the actual body gear itself. Okay, this is the gauntlets. And actually, um, it's very, very, very tricky. Um, let's see. Let go ahead and find that again. And Navicat. The name has to actually match. Um, okay, there we go. And, okay, the name has to actually match um, how it connects to play online. It's kind of hard to explain that. But, yeah, if, it, if the name is not correct, it won't load, basically. Okay. So that's there, and what I'm going to go ahead and do is just show you a folder that we actually need. Um, let me go ahead and go back to the top here. So this is the very tricky part. So if we open uh, here, it's in scripts, globals, and status, LUA. Lua is a programming language. Uh, and this is basically Notepad++. This is basically Notepad with a special, a special Notepad to open different programming files here. So basically, if I just scroll down, I'm going to find it here. And basically what these are, these are different status, like uh, different things that the game um, have to explain. So basically, these numbers here correspond to the actual stat that it, that is in the game. So this is, the, for example, number two would be the uh, HP, number one, defense. Let me just go ahead and show you how this works here in the with the files here and uh, that's in the server here okay so we go to the, the server 
um, so the SQL. So again, SQL is just what this game here is actually communicating with. So when you load that gear, it actually comes here and search for these numbers here. So if I, if I go ahead and type this one, because this I, I searched this a bit earlier. So if I go back to the, not that one, if I go to, again, this is very, very, very confusing here, I know, but you would get used to it after some time. So if I type that number here, it's gonna load up the number one gauntlet. But again, as we know, this one works. The number for number two, number three, they don't work. Okay, so now what I wanna show you is how this actually connects to the game here. So 102 will be the, okay, so 102 defense. Number one, if we go back over here, number one is just a defense. Okay, and number two should be 29 HP. As you see, that works over here as well. So number two is the HP and it gives you 29. So basically with this one here, with the th number three gauntlets, it's not actually loaded into the into the server. So when you load the game, it can't find that that, mo that number, that item ID number, so it won't load the stats. That's basically what's happening. So I'm just gonna quickly demonstrate. I, might, I am running out of time here. <laughs> okay, well, I'm gonna go ahead and demonstrate how this actually works. So I'm like getting myself uh, confused here. Okay, so basically what we're gonna go ahead and do is take this number here, and just to demonstrate, I'm gonna go ahead and just type it here. One, two, oh, not that. Two, three. Just demonstrate four for now. Okay, so with the number three gear, after some time you will get used to it, don't worry. Just, let's go ahead and type it here. Number three. So it's giving us 49, so basically it should be 20 points up from the previous gear. So it should be, okay, 29, it should be 49. So this only gives 10, but it doesn't matter. Okay, so what I wanna go ahead and do is just, just add that here. So defense, let's go ahead and put 122. Or we could just go here as well, let's see. The gauntlet, so it's giving us uh, the strength, 26, or HP, 49. So HP, let's go back to number, so HP will be number two, so two will be 49. Let's go back to that. Yes, again, it's really confused. I didn't have really have a chance to set everything up beforehand. Let's see. Number two, let's go ahead and add 49. Okay, so in this video, I'm just gonna go ahead and just demonstrate these two here. So once you have everything typed in, um, you go back to your table, and what you're gonna do is go ahead and hit, and hit uh, plus. Ah, oh, not that. Well, it's been a while since I've done this, I do apologize. <laughs> okay, let's go ahead and cancel that out like that. Like this, one, two, three, oh no. Not like that, so add. Okay, there's no, <laughs> I don't wanna mess anything up there, so I'm just gonna go ahead and manually type it in. So two, let's see, two, three, five, three, nine. Okay, it's number one. And we're gonna go ahead and add the stats, 122. And then just click save. Add it again. Let's copy and paste it from uh, no, this one here. So just use go ahead and copy and paste. Let's see, plus again. I recommend going down. I don't know why I'm going up there. It just makes it more confusing there. And then add 49. Check. Okay, so if I add those, it's actually not gonna appear just yet. So I have to be a little patient there. So as you see, it's not gonna load anything. So what we're gonna do is go ahead and just restart the server. I'm gonna go ahead and pause the video and we'll be back shortly. Okay, so we went ahead and restarted the server there. Okay, as you see, everything is loaded up just fine. And I'm gonna go ahead and just load the game again. Okay, let's go to my windower. So what we added, we just added the uh, the HP and defense, and we should have those two. Let's go ahead and log in here. Let me go ahead and log into a separate window here. Sorry about that. 